everybody, Soulblade22 here, 2200, my bad, uh, my throat's still a little constrictive and I'm kind of bleh right now. Uh, today is actually a very special day because I'm starting to do a new series of videos called Press Start. And, uh, Press Start is basically, um, I get some friends over, we play some games, maybe co-op or otherwise, the versus mode stuff will be a, a different thing altogether. And uh, today, as you can see, we're going to be playing Injustice Gods Among Us. And with me for the very first episode is my dear friend, Stuart. Stuart, say hello to all the beautiful ladies and gentlemen out there. Sup? So, um, Stuart, I know you've heard of this game. You've seen some playthroughs of this game. You've even watched some things of this game. How does it sit with you? Well... You know, just the really big thing that gets me about this game is you have the people who made Mortal Kombat one of the most famous, maybe maybe among the most popular fighting games that have ever been made, and they decided, you know what, let's make a Mortal Kombat style fighting game, but not Mortal Kombat characters. Let's make it DC characters in a fighting game. And you know what, seeing, like, when I first heard about this, I just thought, wow, how is this going to turn out? Is this going to be, like, the best thing ever? And you know what, after it's been released, and after playing a little bit of it myself, I am just absolutely amazed by this game. I think this game is just great. Yeah, and you know, um, as a side note uh, about the whole making a tournament fighter thing, uh, DC fans have been wanting a tournament fighter of DC Comics for quite a long time. I think the last one was on the Super Nintendo and the Genesis, I think? And it was decent, but um, this actually feels like a true, like, okay, here's a bunch of DC fighters, here's a dream match of everything you could do with this game, and we just got booted to the screen, but that's fine. <laughs> um, as you can see, um, we are going to do story mode. So, uh, whenever this thing loads, and uh, I have played this game a little bit on the side to, to prepare myself for story mode, and, uh, I don't want to toot my own horn here, but, uh, I do like playing as Batman. I know it's cliche because it's Batman, but he's Batman. He's fun. He is Batman. And, um, the Flash is also pretty fun, and actually, b before we start, I do want to know, look at the graphics and the textures for this game. This is a beautiful game. I mean, look at that. I'm already I'm already hyped to beat the heck out of something in this game just from just what I'm looking at alone. Yeah. But anyways, enough enough banter, Stuart. <laughs> we are here to play story mode. So, Indeed. Are you ready? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. All right. Three, two. Hold on. Hold on. I believe there's something else. Hit the mm -hmm. button. Ah, there that's right. We that's go. right. So, um, I forgot to mention. So we did make a first video a while ago. But the thing is, it didn't turn out quite as we expected, so we had to restart. As you can see, we already did part two, and uh, so we're just going to do part one again. But we're just going to pretend like this video never happened. I mean, this is our first video, right, Stuart? What, what, what other video? What are you talking about? There's only this video. Yeah, right? I mean, this is, there was no first video. Yeah. Just, this is the first video. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, uh... From what I've played in this game, I'm very impressed, actually, by, like, the amount of detail that you can tell went into every character, every single thing. I mean, even this cutscene with that... What is that? Um, I believe that's... Oh, what's the name of that? Oh, uh, it's the Daily Planet yeah, Globe. what in the world? Okay, what just... Uh, what happened? Um, if I were to take a guess, it looks like kind of the end of the world um i'm thinking dark side maybe uh doomsday it looks uh, like something doomsday would do well maybe maybe brainiac too he, he's a pretty big villain too he might be able to cause something like this you know that would be a cool lead-in for the game because i know dc universe uh online had brainiac as the main villain and it started out with a cutscene kind of like this where it was like this apocalyptic so maybe it ties into that. Maybe. Who knows? That's we kind what we're of... find out. Ooh, wait, a red door. Wait, wait, wait. No! <laughs> Guess who? No! He did it? 
Joker did it? The nuke. Where'd you get it? He had a nuke? You want one? Copy that. He had a nuke? Uh, well, having a nuke, that wouldn't surprise me too much, but it, this? Um, is, oh, it's Superman. Uh, uh, it's, it's just Superman. Oh, it's just okay. good old Superman. Get away from him. I do like his suit, though. It looks really cool. Yeah, well, I think all their suits look pretty good. Yeah. You know, I, I know I mentioned it before, but... The textures on like the cape and everything looks so good. Oh, it's yeah. amazing, like how good everything me. is now. Lois, my son. There's Krypton now, Metropolis. People you love tend to blow up, don't they? What a jerk! Superman, don't. That, that's the Joker for you, right there. He doesn't give a shit about anyone. Well, except maybe Batman. That's why I like you, Superman. You're much more gullible than... Ha! <laughs> Bat joke. I got it. Yeah. Yep. Um. Ow. Okay. I know this is a totally off topic, but I'm really happy with the voice actors. The voice actors, I mean... The, the guy that plays Joker isn't Mark Hamill, but he's so good at being Joker. Like, I can believe that he's Joker. You know, like, after hearing that Mark Hamill wouldn't be the Joker anymore, I wasn't quite sure what to expect from other voice actors trying to follow in his legacy. But you know, after hearing this voice actor doing the Joker in this game, I am very impressed with the work that they did. I mean, just listen to him. Also, um, the guy that was in Arkham Origins, uh, Troy Baker, he sounds like a younger Mark Hamill, and I think that's really cool. Yeah. That they... Ooh. So, that makes you think. What did he do to the Joker? I know this is the guy's by Mortal Kombat, so I'm expecting some fatality thing up in here. Oh, yeah, definitely. Oh, that's just... That, I mean, that's, that's... Superman just killed somebody, and I know he's killed people before on the comics and everything, but... That's whenever he does it, you're always stunned that he does it. Oh yeah, because he doesn't usually do that. Right. Oh, and uh, looks like we've got another uh, big fight going on here. So, so I'm guessing that this is an, an alternate universe. Oh, well, maybe uh, it, it looks like because like they were talking about the multiverse thing in the beginning. Yeah. You know what? I have to say, I'm really glad with about this right here because this. They have all these really good villains fighting the Justice League as if it's a typical day for the Justice League. And, I mean, look at that. They got Shazam and Black Adam. They had Ares, which I'm really grateful that they're putting in certain villains. Oh, That was a, actually a very good hit. Yeah. L like Ares. I would not expect Ares to be in this game, and here he is. Yep. You know, Aquaman. Exciting. Ha! Aquaman. You know... Let's wrap this up. I have to admit, I do like Aquaman. I think he's a very underrated superhero, and he deserves more... Gosh uh, darn it! Yeah. I knew it! Good old Doomsday. I knew Doomsday was gonna be in this game. <laughs> you know, Clark sometimes forgets he I don't know why, but every time I, I think of Superman, I always think, oh, Lex Luthor or Doomsday. Like, like the, look, there's Lex Luthor. Yep. And Doomsday. Is. Oh, Bane! Hi oh, there, Bane. Bane's in there, too. How about that? And uh, Raven as well. You know, they have a good number of the uh, Teen Titans cast in this game. I mean, you have Raven, you have uh, Nightwing, who was originally Robin, you have Cyborg. Sadly, they don't have a Beast Boy or a Starfire in this game, but you know what? Having the majority of the cast is pretty good. Oh, he's got a Mega Man gun. I'm already a fan of Cyborg. Yep. But, uh, yeah, I have to agree. They could have... Oh, I get to play Batman? Yes! I get to be Batman! I I'm sorry, but... I'll be Batman. I I I'm really good at Batman, so I'm really happy I get to play as him first. Yep. Nice, nice and, uh, little warm-up oh. for you. Hmm? Oh, oh, you sneaky little bugger. That's the Joker for you. Yes. Is it the Joker cell? Well, it's it's somebody. I mean, it could it could be any number of pre people who want to use. Them. Oh, it is Joker. Yeah. Wow, that's a lot of. That's okay. a lot of. Uh, the I'm trap. I'm always so laughing about how. Oh, <laughs> well, what do we have oh, here? Yes. Here this? comes a new challenger. Oh. Ooh, Deathstroke. <laughs> okay, I am looking so forward to beating up ever since Arkham Origins. Yeah. Which was a very good game, by the way. I highly recommend playing that to anyone watching this. 
Arkham Origins is, is a very good game, even though it was not made by Rocksteady. It was made by a different yeah, company. Yep. And now it is time to boss. kick Deathstroke's I gotta ass. Kill that okay. <laughs> uh, I really like what he just said, actually. Uh, what, what uh, Deathstroke just said. Because he's like, oh, I don't really care about the money. I care about taking out the Batman. And in a way, I kind of, both, I kind of agree with that. Because if you were a, a very high-class assassin... Taking out the Batman would be like the biggest thing of your entire career. Oh yeah. Ooh, what's oh. This? Yeah. Ooh. oh, we got cameos. Oh. Fan service. Scarecrow. That creepy as all get out. Ha! Ha! Swing on that chandelier. Boot to the face. So, um, I, I was saying before how I really like how Batman plays, and I like how he's kind of a balanced character. Oh, more fan oh, service! Oh, we got yeah. Croc, we have Croc, <laughs> Penguin, we have Two Face, we have the Riddler. Wow, that that's a lot of fan service oh, in, in one. Game. And of course, there's Poison Ivy yeah, there's and uh, uh, Poison Ivy back there. And uh, Mr. And Freeze's then, uh, thing was over there. On the other side. And if you uh, look in the center over there, Ooh, I believe you will see, uh, a little bit over, there is Dr. Hugo Strange. Just being a troll as usual. Freaking Hugo. Okay. Uh, Deathstroke, you gonna come at me, bro? Oh, oh, you gonna oh, come at me? Oh, 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 no? Alright. I'm ending this. Uh, um. Sorry, Deathstroke. No He's still trolling. And, and, and Hugo Strange is like, yeah. Look, like, he was even walking with Batman like, yes, well done, I, Batman. I, well, I, good I, fight. I, I, I'm going to observe you. Freaking troll. He's In Arkham City, he was the biggest... I, I hated I, him in Arkham City. I, I loved how he do. died. Oh, yeah. And <laughs> everyone teamed me up on Doomsday. Oh, well, yeah. need to. And... Uh, oh, Shazam! Get up. No. Uh -huh. Oh, wow. He transformed him back into normal yep. Adam. Please tell me he dies. Oh, that, no. That, that would be green arrow, don't romantic. do it. Don't. Oh, uh, green arrow. Oh. You know, okay, I like Black Adam as a villain, but if he just died, so many problems would be solved. I know, that? right? Thunder of the gods, Flash. Thunder of the gods. What does that make us? Wow, that, that's actually kind of deep, isn't it? It is. I mean, I, I I agree with you. That was pretty. Uh... Slobs will clean up the mess. Oh. Oh. Well, well that's I, guess, I guess that's what they are. That's kind of depressing. Oh well. Well, as long as they're okay with their lot, I guess. Ooh. Okay. I, I think it's kind of interesting how uh, I, I was gonna say earlier no further that uh, they've actually have a pretty good cast of villains right now. Yep. Oh. Oh, I get to fight Luthor. Minutes to break your encryption. Nice work. Oh god, please tell me I have to beat up Lex. No! Uh -oh. No! Give me Luthor, damn it! No! No! You have to fight him now. So I'm okay no, with break your back. Okay, well, we're gonna stop it right there, because uh, we don't know how much of a video we made. I know we, we talked a lot in the beginning, and I'm very sorry about that, but that was just to get some stuff out of the way. Um, and that was part one. I am looking forward to playing more of this. How about you, Stuart? I think this is a great game, and I am so stoked to seeing more of the great story and more of the awesome fights that you get to do. I'm totally looking forward to you know, playing and, this game. And this also raises the question, we've already seen a lot of the villains, but are there going to be more villains? that Maybe we don't play, but maybe they're just, like, around? Like, I know that we saw, um... Hugo Strange and whatnot in the background. I wonder if, like, Gorilla Grodd's gonna come out of nowhere, or, uh... I would... I, I still haven't seen Martian Manhunter in, in this game yet. It's and true. I, I know he's DLC, so I'm wondering... I know he wasn't a normal character in the game, so I wonder if he's even in the game. Well, I guess we'll just have to play and find out. Yeah, that's that's true. All right, um... Well, that's part one, everybody. Thank you very much for tuning in to the very first episode of Press Start. I'm your host, Soulblade2200, and I will see you next time!